takriban wagonjwa 19 waliolanzwa katika hospitali ya Nakuru War Memorial wamehamishwa kuelekea kituo vituo vingine au kuruhusiwa kwenda nyumbani baada ya maafisa wa serikali ya kaunti ya Nakuru kudaiwa kuvamia kituo hicho saa tisa unusu kwa mkia Jumanne kuwafukuza wauguzi na kuwahamisha wagonjwa waliolanzwa humo kuelekea hospitali ya Nakuru Annex aidha mapema alfajiri kizaza kilishuhudiwa kwa takriban dakika 30 baada ya naibu msajili wa mahakama ya Nakuru Priska Nyota kuzuiliwa kuingia kukagua kituo hicho licha ya kuwa na amri ya mahakama iliyomtaka kubaini hali ya hospitali hiyo kufuatia madai kwamba uvamizi wa uh, na uharibifu wa mali ulitokea jana usiku nyota aliruhusiwa baadaye kuingia kituo hicho ambacho sasa kimesalia mahame kufuatia hatua hiyo waguzi wachacha walikuwa wamebaki kusaidia wagonjwa waliokuwa naruhusiwa kwenda nyumbani pamoja na wagonjwa mgonjwa mmoja aliyelazwa katika kitengo cha wagonjwa wa mahututi mwakili wa war memorial Ameelezea kuwa ataishtaki serikali ya kaunti ya Nakuru kwa kukiuka amri za mahakama. The county government trust in the judicial office in the judicial system. Then why did they take or instigate the directors to be charged in the court of law and it is the same same court which are issuing orders which they are blatantly disobeying but at the same same time they want justice from those courts i think it's a total contradiction so we are now headed back to court so that the deputy registrar can file her, her report she has seen what is happening and then we can take the case to the next level just come from seeing a patient uh, from icu we were trying to organize how an ambulance can be brought so that he can be transferred to another facility you will note that this is even against the patient's will because the patient willingly came to War Memorial Hospital to seek health services but because of these wrangles he has to be transferred to another hospital at another expense. I've just been talking to another uh, person who has come to visit their, their, their loved one, their patient. They have found the patient has also been transferred. They don't know where the patient was and he was also in ICU. I can tell you as LSK we are collecting evidence on uh, possible violation on human rights because the right to health care is a constitutional right and it will not be violated by anyone.